They say one person's junk is another one's treasure. For Greta Hoken, the neighborhood's junk is her allowance. We were just talking about current events, so we were talking about the strike. And my dad said it would be a great opportunity for entrepreneurs. This 13-year-old has found a way to profit from the city's garbage strike one bag at a time. I went out and I put flyers in my neighborhood and I sent out emails and people were interested. Far drive and people really don't want to stink up their cars by putting the garbage in. So that's why it appeals to people. Greta is spending her summer days off going door to door in her neighborhood, signing up clients and taking their garbage off their hands at the ripe cost of seven bucks a bag. I was thinking about making it five bucks a bag, but then I did the math and I realized that wasn't going to be enough. And if you don't think that's business savvy enough, Greta then struck a deal with a private junk company to collect it all. No harm, no foul smell, right? I said to her, why are you doing it? She goes, I want to be an entrepreneur. I was like, that is great. You know, that in itself was just a wonderful thing to do. She goes, no one wants to hire me. I'm too young. So I went out and found something I could do. So what do her parents think of the piles of garbage on their driveway? Lucky for them, the garbage company is prompt. I honestly took it and put it on the driveway, and then they showed up like five minutes later. Greta understands her summer business may not be winning her any friends among the striking garbage workers, but that said, she doesn't mind if the strike goes on for a while. I'm only 13, so I seem really young, but some young people have some of the brightest minds, and if you just put your mind to it, you can do it. Anthony Robart, Global News.